Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 46 of Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, we only have one challenge run left before we can get started on the Purist, which I'm going to save for later. So, let's go to Glass Cannon, which we unlocked recently. Oh, I'm so glad to have Epic Fetus back. Looks like we got Book of Belial as well. Alright, so here's our seed. Z, S, Z, 2, wow, man, if you have bad eyes, they pretty much all look the same. 7, A, E, 2. Alright, we got Book of Belial, Loki's Horns, and Epic Fetus. Why Loki's Horns? Well, you're gonna find out why soon enough. So we gotta be very careful, we're playing as Judas, so one hit's gonna kill us. Oh god, I didn't know there was a rock right there. So yeah, Loki's horns will actually allow you to shoot four missiles in certain instances. Kind of wish you could control like when those bombs drop, but you don't. They drop at a set time. Also, I should be looking for secret rooms because now they have unlimited resources. I can. Oh, there's our top secret room. Wiggle worm. Well, it doesn't really affect Epic Fetus. I'm so glad they made Epic Feet as still as strong as it's always been. Oh, shit. That can put you in a bad spot, too. Because you're going to be steering all four of these at once. That can be real good. Or real bad. When it comes to Monstro, you really need to time your shots right. Okay, we'll take our HP upgrades for a lot more survivable. Now, let's do our due diligence and explore for a moment. Now, you really have to watch all four crosshairs very carefully. Or you're just gonna shoot yourself in the foot and, well, pretty much every other part of your body. We really don't want that. Oh, there's our regular secret room. That sucks. I don't want to play it. I'll take the bomb that I'll probably never be needing. I'll take those two cents I might be needing. There was no other entrance there? Okay, we'll go down here then. Oh, I can't. Ah, uh, yeah, that's probably still by factor of that patch. That I won't allow you to bomb out of secret rooms effectively, or in some special rooms you can't bomb out of. Huh, didn't even need Book of Belial for that one. Take our strength card, and then we'll get out of here. Actually, I should check out our shop. Eh, not that great. I think I'll just buy the key, and then I'll leave. I'm not gonna buy that soul heart either. I, I feel confident in my survivability. Because if you got the most powerful item in the game, in my humble opinion, you pretty much don't have to worry about protecting yourself that much, unless you keep dropping them on yourself. Okay, looks like it ends in Mom's heart. If it ended in Mom, that'd be way too easy. Oh, jeez. This would be a good idea to, like, destroy all those rocks. So now... <sighs> fuck. I destroy the rocks and I still got hit. Because then you create a little safe haven for yourself. Which apparently wasn't safe enough. Because I still took damage. Like a little fucktard. Alright, we'll use Book of Belial right here. Oh, I almost destroyed it. Now I have to destroy these spiders. Which, thankfully, I did. <laughs> we'll take our deal with the devil and in it to a... a... Shovel? You know what? The shovel could be interesting. I normally don't take the shovel. Because it's bad compared to Book of Belial. But I have enough firepower anyway, so let's go for it. We'll take the shovel. We'll use it right here. Because there was already an exit, I'm guessing... Guarantees your chance for a trap door for the most part? I can't say it's a guarantee, but it's pretty damn close. Okay, there's a lot of health over here, or potential health. Which hopefully isn't right here. Ooh, this could be interesting. I think I want to give my money to the beggar instead. But what do I want to give up my heart on? Maybe Steam Sale, actually. I don't need BOGO bombs. I don't need to worry about the blue map, because I can just blow them up as much as I want. 
but the more potential for good secret rooms would be much better for me. Another strength card, really? Don't pick that up by accident, thank you. Did I destroy that uh, key beggar? I think I did. So if you use the shovel correctly, you can pretty much just get yourself like black markets every single time. You know, potential black markets every single time. I can't say it's a guarantee, but it'd be pretty damn close. You just gotta play your cards right, literally. That was a good uh, use of that. Eh, fish heavy better than wiggle worm. Because it actually does something with this kind of run. Boom. Now, what's this pill? Ah, puberty. Well, it's not a bad pill. It just does nothing special for ya. It just gives me pubes. That's all it does. Now I'm pube head. Ooh, petrified pube. I think I'd rather that over fish head. Because now it allows poop to pay out more effectively. Or at least more frequently. Oh, you, you're still alive. Maybe the one thing I don't like about Epic Fetus is that you do fire pretty slowly. That might be the lone disadvantage. That you have to wait for it to drop. But when it does, look out. I think I can steer this uh, regular chest my way. Oh, found a secret room. Come on, get a little closer. Thank you. It is always very cool to actually just steer in items like that. Just using your bombs. Yeah, maybe this is like uh, something correct. Like you can't bomb into shops now. It probably just adds a little balancing feature. Uh, oh, this is a tough decision. I think we should take the jar. No, but then I lose the shovel. Fuck. That was a bad decision on my part. I forgot that the jar was a spacebar item. Should have taken the ladder instead. Oh, ghost baby. Well, that's not great, but I'll take it. I still have something that fires tears. Albeit, uh, my missiles are more powerful than tears will ever be. Oh! Why did I not move from that? Should have just gone to the other side of the room. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay, I'll just save the shovel for when we uh, clear out the boss. When we have a trap door for the next floor anyway. Bible tract? I think I'd rather petrified poop. Now let's take on the fallen. Oh, that was a good time. Oh, I have default speed, don't I? Goat head, fine, thanks. There we go. There's a good use of the shovel right there. Oh, well, this is not gonna be any good. Eh, yeah, give me some money so I can probably go back and buy that ladder. So as long as I use the shovel, like, anywhere where there's an exit anyway. Oh, now we gotta deal with the double. Oh, it's Krampus. Oh, why did I not move from that? What was I thinking? Krampus' head? Nah, I don't think I'm gonna stick with that. I'm gonna stick with a shovel. It's actually been so good an item for me. Like, that and Notched Axe have definitely redeemed themselves. Maybe we'll stick with Bible Tract. Eh, no, I think I'm gonna stick with Petrified Poop. So we'll take the ladder. Even though the key is tempting. And we'll get out of here. There, it gives me a little bit more maneuverability. Now I just need a speed upgrade stat. Or we're in trouble. Definitely need to get our fortunes a little bit higher. That could help. That really helped. Nothing too groundbreaking, but still. It can be useful. No secret rooms over here? No. Fine. 
Have it your way. And that soul heart is mine. I just realized how low of health I have right now. So I have to be a little bit more diligent at keeping myself alive. And... Yeah, I guess it's just special rooms you can't bomb into ever again. For now, at least. I don't know if it's gonna stay that way permanently. That would kinda suck, though. Because that was a good thing to take advantage of. Even though it did seem like a broken tactic at times. But it was still a good tactic. Oh, Lucky Rock. I can't reach that. I need like two ladders and you can't get them. <coughs> Excuse me. I kind of wish I could get that evil heart though. What I really need right now is the ability to fly. That would be so good right now. But I guess that's not gonna happen anytime soon. Also, I don't know why I went that way. There's just no way for the boss to be there. God, just nothing but bonies. That's all I've been finding in the caves. Anything good in these shrooms? Don't say that in front of your parents, kids. That would be taken the wrong way in so many ways. Bad trip. Now I lost my soul heart. Speed down? My speed always shitty enough as is. Oh, balls of steel. That's good. And range up. Well, range doesn't matter. The speed down just sucks real bad. So if I gotta fight war in the depths or necropolis, that, that's gonna be real bad. That's gonna put me in a situation where I could be easily screwed. Not to mention my speed was already bad, and to make it worse, it's just going to really shank me. Range doesn't even do anything for me. Okay, Mob's Purse, I'll definitely take that. Uh, nah, I don't think I'm gonna buy anything else. This, oh, I thought that was Balls of Steel. I just forgot it was a bad trip. I'll keep the Strength card. Never thought I need to use it that yet, though. I'm pretty sure I will eventually. What's this? Ah, Hagalaz. I don't really need it. Okay, Chubb is no problem. I should clear out those rocks first. Like, well, maybe Hagalaz would have been useful to Aerophone, though. You know, like a uh, past me would say, if you look into the future. Oh, matchbook is good. Alrighty then. Uh, Spirit of the Night. You know what? Let's get crazy. We're gonna take it. This could be frightening, but... All in all, very exciting is at the same time. Oh, I guess it doesn't always create it like a black market. I guess it just creates two exits this time. I guess I can go back for that evil heart now that I have the ability to fly. I'm gonna go back for a couple other things. Actually, this might be the only thing I can go for. But that's still pretty good. Oh, the lucky rock. I think I'd rather that. So if I can destroy all these rocks, I mean, I'm getting a shit ton of money. Was that a tinted rock there that I just blew up? Because I didn't even know that was there. But I guess I'll find tinted rocks a little bit easier knowing that I'm going to be destroying pretty much any kind of rock. That's last name is not Johnson, by the way. And I think it's time for us to go to the next floor. Alright. Let's see what else I can buy in that shop that can keep me alive. I think I'll buy a key. Agalaz is useless to me. I'll take this trap door because I made it myself. Well, in that case, I should probably just be using the shovel more often. Oh, curse the lost. Are you kidding me? Maybe that was a bad idea to try to get those bombs when I had, like, a crosshair active. 
Because that could have dropped on me real fast. Oh, yes. Epic beat is so awesome. Alright, I have Petrified Poop and the uh, Lucky Rock. I just realized about Mom's Purse. Oh, Paralysis, eh. Sure, let's go for it. Monkey Paw? I think that allows me to create like an evil heart in certain situations. Like when I'm really low on health. Thank God that died quickly. Oh. Oh, oh. Come on. Aim it just right. Yes. I think we'll go with Monkey Paw Lucky Rock. That would be a good idea. Petrified poop is kind of redundant because you mostly find more rocks than you. Oh, fuck. Because you find more rocks than you do poop. So now I just create an even worse situation for myself because now I can only take three more hits of Epiphetus. And because this ends in Mom's heart, I mean, we're eventually going to be taking one full heart of damage in certain rooms anyway. Yeah. But I had to take Spirit of the Night. I mean, it was just worth the risk that I was going to be doing. Hmm, I find that when you use, you get the Loki's Horns effect, that the other shots just trail off on their own. Seems that way. That being said, however, we're still in a very good position to win. It's just going to get more harrowing at the end, though. You're still alive. You can't have that. That's the wrong way. So, yep. You all deceased. That's the thing I hate about Curse of the Lost. I mean, anytime you can't have use of your map, it's real bad. I mean, I could just leave and go to the next floor if I really wanted to. Oh, wall monsters. Oh, found an evil heart in there. Thanks. You. Yeah, I remember I can bomb out of these rooms too if I wanted to. A was okay. I just created another exit. Whoa, 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 whoa! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Did those other crosshairs just go closer to me? That's scary. Oh my god! Did you really create like four hosts out of this? That's going to be so annoying. You have to fire early. What? Did I go into that shot like a moron? I did, didn't I? Uh, yep, we definitely got to buy that soul heart. I might try out this pill. Ah, oh, it's telepills. Um, where am I in proportion to the shop? Because I want to go back. Oh my god, I'm... I think I'm really far away here. Who knows where I am right now? Like, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore, guys. Oh, there's a tarot card right there. It's Hangman. I'll use it because it's worthless. Okay, I think we're going in the right way for, like, where we were before. Oh, I move so goddamn slow. Yeah, we'll charge it up. We'll use it right here. You know, we'll just buy everything. Boss is probably over that way. If I was a guessing man, which I usually am. I don't always guess right, though. But that's the nature of the beast. No guesser can be right 100% of the time. That's just impossible. Uh, eventually, the most right people have to be wrong at some point. Oh yeah, we would fight war. I was talking about this being a problem with my low speed. And lo and behold, there he is. Uh, at least you're creating money for me. Okay, I can just steer the other shots. Ok, 
Yeah, I have to do this just right. Like, to the point that I can hit war, but not destroy the rocks. There we go. No. Screw you, demon baby. I am not taking you. You will do me more harm than good. Luckily, I have a lot of keys. So, yeah, Keybagger can take them. Don't take too many of them, though. Okay, at least give me somewhere I can get a key back. That's beautiful. Oh, he just gives me the paperclip. Uh, I think I would rather paperclip Lucky Rock. Now gold chests are no longer an issue for the rest of the game. Well, until I drop the paperclip. Which I have no intentions of doing. Oh! That could have been worse. Oh, that soul heart came in at a good time. So did that one. Beautiful. Yeah, I gotta realize you can't just bomb out of special rooms these days. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Those blasts were way too close to me. Man, when you get like the four way shot, I mean, that could be real bad. So, I should avoid getting lock-off pills. Because otherwise, I'm going to get this effect way too frequently. Oh, there's our trap door. Ugh, that's not very good. What is it? Okay, well, that, that wasn't too bad. That was a good haul. I was kind of hoping for a pedestal item, though. Heh, <laughs> I like that little pop. What could I really use right now? Mr. Mega, for sure. Make these bombs even more death-defying. Or death-bringing. That would be a more proper term. Ten of rock right over there. Beautiful. Lover's card is kind of worthless. Well, actually, it is worthless. Strength card could be okay. I'm going to keep that. This is the case where Paperclip is very useful. Able, probably not so useful. Unless you had, like, BBF or something. Well, I guess it does provide support fire. Oh my god, what is that? The biggest obese orgy ever! Jesus! That is frightening. Hey, those are mine. You can't have them. Back off, get your own sandwich. Oh, what's this tarot card? I'm dying to know. Two of spades! Double my keys, sure. Two of diamonds! Bring me to 99 cents, awesome. Fine, do it again, I don't care. High Priestess, not worth it. Strength card. Yeah, I think I'd rather that over High Priestess. Oh, you scum. Go after the ones that don't charge at ya. You're more likely to hit him then. Oh, 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 too late. There. Well, there's our boss. Oh, I can just leave right now. It creates those kind of trap doors. I might as well just take on Mom. No reason not to. Other than to save time. Do we really need to save time that badly? Destroy those rocks because they could throw the enemies off. Well, throw me off when dealing with the enemies. Oh, damn it. The real problem is like getting the timing right to hit the right parts of her face. Okay, but it looks like we're real close. Oh my god. There! Okay, we'll take the Polaroid. And our Devil Room, that this all sucks. Poor Babylon might... Nah, it's not going to be useful with this. We'll just leave. And then we'll take on what awaits us. Oh man, I move so damn slow. 
There better be a speed up pill in the rotation. Otherwise, we're gonna have some problems. Yeah, I think I'd rather 26 keys if you got Epic Fetus. 26 bombs is kind of worthless. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Hit one of them! Thank you! That was the one I wanted to take care of the most because I had that bomb attached to it. Oh, no, no, don't want that. Do not want... Is the top secret room right here? No. Oh, man. This could probably be an absolute war of attrition. Just to move around. Even just right, you get two of them. Beautiful. That's pride. Well, pride's not a problem. It just it doesn't really drop a good item. The hermit? Sure. I see it. I was hoping it would send me closer to the boss, but it didn't. Instead, it sent me further away from the boss. So let me go back for that strength card. And be done with this scum. Oh, create another trap door. We're getting really lucky with those, at least. Mom's toenail, no. I don't like that trinket. To be honest, I was kind of hoping it would just create the exit for me instead of a trap door. Because then I can just get out of here and focus on Mom's heart faster. That was beautiful. That also was awesome. Why am I picking up these pennies if I'm at max? Oh, found a secret room. Yeah, it's a regular one. Okay. Found some pills. Range up is useless. Purity is useless. Speed down is terrible. Pills have been bad for me. This is like the anti-drug episode of Isaac here. <laughs> like, drugs are bad. Okay. Sometimes they'll just speed you right down and then you'll just grow pubes on top of your head. Do you really want to grow pubes? And a lot of guys been singing, Yeah, so I can bang some chicks, man. Seriously, I mean, if you want to, like, uh, have sex with a girl, it would be better to have, like, very few pubes so you don't tickle them as much. I know women don't like to have pubes when they're having sex and stuff. Don't you like a little smooth ride? I, you know what I mean? What am I talking about? Right, let's just move on here and just deal with Blast Assist. Oh, we'll take the growth hormones. That gives me that extra speed I was looking for. That gave me an extra solar. Don't pick up Book of Sin. And then we can get out of here. What happens if I, like, uh, create that little trap door? Do I instantly win? Well, it takes me to Shoal, I believe. I guess, I mean, if I got a lot of money, I'll just give it to these guys. I have a lot of keys as well. Really? Mom's coin purse after what we've seen? All the shit- oh, no, 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 no. Really? You could have paid out so well. Well, if I'm gonna get some invincibility, I might as well just milk it for what it's worth. Oh, don't take too much damage, though. I don't want to take the virus. Telepills. Balls of steel is good. I don't want to go in that trap door, because I'm worried that I might just screw up my victory chances. Why am I doing a lot of damage? Like, I'm just seeing, like, the shakedown of my bombs now. Oh, wall monsters. Yes, I got two of them. That's beautiful. Now, we just need to find Mom's heart, and that's not the way to get there. Oh, you know why I'm doing more damage? Growth hormones. That's why I've noticed my bomb's doing the uh, earthquake kind of damage. That gold key's kind of worthless now. Oh my god, more wall monsters. Is there only one? I think there's only one. And I walk right into that. Oh, there was a second one. That was a time when Loki's horns really screwed me. 
Oh my god, I didn't even see that. Gotta be more careful. This is not... Is this still the way to the boss? It can still be the way to the boss. Abel is probably not gonna help me much. What's over here? Nothing. Oh, another be beggar. That's good. You could really pay it with something useful. Another HP upgrade? That makes me feel better. Demon Judgment is probably not saying I want to take advantage of. Oh, God. Wait, you can find placenta on these? Huh. I didn't know that. That was an interesting find. Why'd I do that? Okay, there's a trap door. Might be something really game breaking in here. Let's find out. <laughs> Flat penny. I don't really need that many keys. Even though I can get a gaggle of them through this room alone. They're not worth it to me anymore. You know, I'm just gonna bomb my way out and not deal with this guy. There we go. And we'll do a mouse heart. If I aim it just right, I'll hit both of them. Ah, never mind. I feel like I can fire these off a lot faster. Oh, yeah. There's no hope for you, man. Poor mom. Okay, I guess we have to go to Shoal now. So that's where the challenge run ended. That's why we were getting all these trap doors. Will we still get them? No, it doesn't work, so this is the last floor. Not on your life. Oh! I almost took some dumb damage there. I still can if I'm not careful. And this is Jera! Oh yes. Definitely use it right here. That's a free HP upgrade right there. I should have waited. As soon as I saw that other fire, I'm thinking, yeah, that's gonna be a soul heart, isn't it? And surely enough, it was. I would have greater survivability had I just waited before using Jera. I mean, when I saw two eternal hearts, I was just excited. And then I realized it could have been a little bit better. What if I die by one hit, and it's all because of that? Like, just that one little mistake could really ruin it for the rest of the run. Imagine if that happened. I don't think that's going to happen. That's absolute hyperbole. But I'm just saying, imagine. Imagine there's no fetus dropping from these... Bo oh, shit. Okay. Rooms with little spiders are pretty much going to be the most worrisome. Mega Fatty will also be annoying, but at least we do a lot of damage to him. That bomb could have easily hit me. Okay. We're still alive. That's a dead end. Very disappointing. But it's not a terrible one. Oh, there's a secret room. And there's three cents, as if that's really going to save my life. Oh, there was no room to the right. Yep. No, forget it. Shell is useless, so... Eh, Haglass is also useless. Oh dear. I've taken way too many hits in that one room. It's all gonna come down to whether I use Jera way too fast. This is what that's run has done right now. Like, this is the ultimate X-Factor. Did I jump the gun with that item or that rune? I don't really like this room. All because of the whole dicking around you gotta do, just to aim at those enemies. So I just figured I'd just blow my way out of there. Don't take that the wrong way, people. Okay, good, I did not fire that off too early. Speed is still pretty terrible. Oh dear. I never realized how low my health was! 
So we'll pop the strength card right now. It'll give me one extra hit. But that's all it's gonna give me. But that was all I needed. We won. Holy shit. Rules card? Hmm. Don't know how I feel about that one. It could be really good, but it also could be really terrible. Okay, so Purist is the only challenge run that's left. But I'm going to hold off on that one. Alright, so in the next episode, we're just going to do some more vanilla runs. See you everybody. Thanks for watching.